Hello and welcome to um, If Walls Could Talk. I'm Michael Levitt, Associate Editor of Walls and Ceilings. And today we have a special episode as we speak to the magazine, to our uh, winner of this year's Contractor of 2023, Trisco Construction Systems. Uh, Walls and Ceilings, along with its editorial advisory board, has carefully reviewed and selected many companies that we believe hold all the check marks of what it means to be considered for this honor. And after reviewing many companies, um, we kept coming back to Tristo Construction Services of uh, Lima, Ohio. So today I'll be speaking with Steve and Brian Walter from Trisco. Um, Steve, Brian, congratulations to both of you. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Steve and Brian, um, can you tell us what it means to be named contractor of 2023? I guess I'll go first. Um, actually, it's kind of a surprise. <clears throat> uh, it's a... Uh, uh, we, I guess, we're very proud to hear that that we have been selected for that, and it's nice to know that uh, that our team, uh, it's because of our team and everybody around us that uh, you folks have chosen us as contractor of the year. Obviously, we can't do it all on our own. We do it with our with our team and our our workforce, or work, everybody else that supports us. Um, so, yeah, we were really kind of shocked, surprised, and and uh, and very proud. Yeah, I'll also echo that. We're very proud to be uh, to be named Contractor of the Year. Uh, it is kind of a um, it lets us know that the the hard work that we put in day in and day out, making customers happy and um, and giving our employees a, a great place to work, uh, pays off in the end. So, can you tell us about the company? Um, when when it was founded, uh, what your roles are with the company, um, what areas you you guys uh, or what areas or region the company works in and similar information? Sure. I guess I'll start off on that. Uh, our company was founded in, in 1936 uh, by our grandfather. So we're getting ready to enter our, our 88th year in business, uh, doing nothing other than exterior restoration, cleaning eaves, and uh, we, we perform our work pretty much throughout the Midwest over to the East Coast. We're actively in, in six states as we speak with multiple crews. And we have anywhere from, you know, the mid twenties to 30 uh, projects going at any you know, given point in time. Uh, so uh, Brian and I are partners, uh, third generation uh, in the in the company. Uh, we've worked together for darn near 40 years. And uh, we both have, uh, sons in the business. So we actually have fourth generation uh, working for us now. Anything you want to add, Brian? No, um, Steve pretty well uh, summar summarized it up. I think you, you asked what we do for the company. Uh, Steve has, for most of those 40 years, been in charge of sales and marketing for the company and estimating. And uh, I've been in charge of uh, production. That is, in, in our world, that means getting the work done. So Steve gets the jobs and I get the, I get the projects done. So what, everything that that entails, warehouse uh, and field, field crews, uh, material, rentals, equipment, and, and all that. So um, Steve has his thing and I do my thing. We've worked well together. Uh, we complement each other, in my opinion, very well. So that's how we do it. Um, so I know you mentioned you do um, mainly EAPS work. And that's, I think um, that's mainly restorative and maintenance services, I believe. Um, I believe yeah, you said. Um, yeah, that's correct. Yeah, we're uh, our, our, our mainstay since day one has been in the restoration business. Uh, so we deal with all uh, substrates, masonry, concrete, uh, pretty much anything <clears throat> that you can uh, put on the outside of a building, including uh, EAPS. But our specialty is, is, like you said, Eve's uh, restoration, renovation, rejuvenation. Um, that's where our field guys are, are tuned into uh, the restoration side of things. Uh, they're excellent with the, with the detail, um, water mitigation, you know, water prevention, and all that type of thing. And, and in our world, if you can stop the water from getting in the building or give it a good access point out, who cares what the what the cladding system is? So. Um, that's that's really our specialty, and then it lends itself over into in coatings and sealants. But it's all been uh, all in the in the restoration, renovation, and and re rejuvenation world. Did you work with stucco systems as well? Then, yes, we do. You know, that's a little bit more of a specialty. Uh, 
uh, trade, uh, primarily more, you know, in the southern climes. Uh, there's not as much stucco up in, in, in this part of the country, but we also work with stucco systems, yes. Um, how have the past few years gone for, for your company? Um, we've, it's been a, it's been a wild ride. It's, I can, it's, it's, Brian can definitely attest to that. I mean, going back to, uh, you know, even go back into the COVID years, uh, you know, construction was deemed necessary. So, uh, we, you know, we made a lot of changes, a lot of provisions, and, you know, we're really concerned about everyone's safety and Brian can really attest to what we have to do with our, our employees and our field guys, but we're able to, to work um, nonstop, never had to lay anybody off. I uh, had a record year, followed by another record year, followed by another record year. And this year is when I thought the string of record years are going to be over. We've, we're, we're in the process of putting a pin in this one. So uh, yeah. we've been very blessed, been very fortunate and uh, been uh, a little bit of luck. We, you know, these last these last several years have been our biggest years and, and all, all the way around our biggest years in sales and and also in biggest projects we've ever done. And uh, also, uh, really, just the the end result has has always has been good. Good quality projects at a good, um, good value for the owners. What does the future hold for the company, both short and long term? We we like to say that this is kind of a niche business. That um, you know, if we close the doors tomorrow, the phone would still keep ringing, and we have a lot of long term customers and. And anybody that owns building or buildings, they all have problems. And, you know, we like to think that we're, um, we're highly skilled in, in being able to diagnose those problems and, and correct those problems. So um, near term, uh, everything bodes well, I think, for, you know, 2024, uh, near side, far side. Um, you know, everything's up. Um, you know, we're looking at, uh, you know, future changes possibly within the company and in future growth and other possibilities that, that are, are coming across. So um, I think Brian will, will attest to this. I mean, we're doing things now that 10 years ago, we never even dreamed we'd be doing. And, you know, so 10 years from now, who knows what we'll be doing, but we're, we're pretty nimble and we, we like to try new things and, um, and, and have really never backed away from a challenge. Uh, any closing words from either of you? Well, it's, for me, it's a it's an honor, and I'm sure if I speak for Steve, Steve as well. It's an honor to be named as uh, Walls and Ceilings Contractor of the Year, and we're very appreciative for the honor, and uh, and we will we will uh, wear that honor with with pride for sure throughout the company. Definitely, we can't quite honestly can't wait to to share the uh, the news with with all of our employees and and all of our our field personnel because I know there'll be a sense of pride. Uh, that they'll all uh, take in as well. And uh, we, we really plan to, to do a big splash with this. And again, like Brian said, we are very proud and, and honored to be selected and, and uh, uh, quite honestly, quite shocked. But nice to know that uh, what we've been doing for all these years, for what, 87, almost 88 years, has is, is been recognized by such a, a quality uh, organization and magazine as Walls and Ceiling. Well, thank you to both Steve and Brian Walter for their time talking about the company. Um, congratulations again to both of you and your company, all your employees, um, everyone at Trisco Con Construction Services for being named construct uh, contractor of 2023. Um, we also have our cover story for the December issue also talks about um, your company. So um, anyone lis uh, listening, watching right now, Want to learn more about the company? Check out the article, um, I uh, and that has um, contact information for your company as well. Um, if you want to contact us, it's um, wconline.com. Um, uh, I'm Michael Levitt, associate editor, and um, we'll see you next time. Thank you. Thank you.